Alright guys, I'm here with my man Flem Show and he's an Instagram fitness model. We're gonna show you our favorite ab routine. And he was just saying you've been working on your abs up until like eight months ago, nine months ago. Not even been working like six months ago. I was to be in the kitchen. I'm a big fan of weighted ab movements. I think that once you relatively lean, if you just build those blocky abs and you get to like 10% body fat, you're gonna look crazy aesthetic like you know what other is. Like you know, it just has those blocky aesthetic abs. I'm gonna show you my favorite ab routine. He's gonna show you his favorite ab routine. You ain't got no games. You ain't got no weights. <laughs> Like your momentum's gonna wanna go back this way, try to keep it stable. So try to go, I don't know, 10, 15 rep range on this. Here we go. Too many thoughts on my mind, I can't sleep at night, so I just keep writing. I don't need no help, I don't need opinions, so don't waste my time then. I just been living online, my city don't show me no love and that's fine. Fuck local radio stations, I got more plays than all of these rappers combined. I'm going, I'm going again, I've been going in, I'm fed up with so many things, I gotta just let it all out, I'm talking about. My favorite thing to do, just to kind of keep the workout fast paced, is one person's gonna do a weighted plank pole, the other person's gonna do a rope run. You're basically gonna switch off and do three or four rotations in between your workouts. So, so the goal with this one, Start off with like a plate on your plate on your back. So you're gonna put it right here. Oh, that's good. So the goal is 60 second hold. I'm gonna bust out 15. I put the team on my back. I do it all for the family. Everyone that they can rap. Nobody ever gonna challenge me. Starting my week on a Sunday, and then they can make it a one day. I just been ready to take off. Where my turn on the runway? Never be turning around. Never be turning around. Hey. So this is on. Just make sure you don't land on your head. So you want to wrap your legs around. <laughs> Get a little bleak. I like it. Ooh. It's too bad. Oh yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, so I love working with those bleaks getting torn up. I found one of my best exercises to just be grabbing onto a cable, taking the handle off, facing forward, and kind of crunching to the side, tucking it up as deep as you can, exhaling as you crunch, squeeze, come up nice and slow, and repeat. This is why it's so good to work out with other people. I've never done this exercise in my life. I've been in the gym for like 10 years. <laughs> it's good though, you feel right here. Abs and calves are dominant, so they respond better to like 15 to 20 rep range, where like the thighs, tries and chest are more fast switch dominant, so if you want to grow those, it's like, you know, 8 to 10 reps of failure, more intensity. So we're going to show you two variations. I'm sure you guys have this at your gym. We're here at the Mecca Bodybuilding. They got a bunch of crazy contraptions here. So they got this little roll-up machine for abs as well. So we're gonna show you both variations. And uh, the main thing is try to tense your abs before you start the movement so you keep a you don't like dip your lower back. I put the team on my back. I do it all for the family. Everyone that they can rap. Nobody ever gonna challenge me. Starting my week on a Sunday, and then they can make it a one day. I just been ready to take off. Where did my turn on the runway? Never be turning around, never be turning around. Alright, guys, so we just got a little post workout meal here on the beach. We are in the iconic Venice Beach area. And obviously, we showed you our favorite ab exercises in this video, but if you don't have at least 10, 11% body fat, all those ab exercises aren't gonna mean anything. So I am six foot, 195-ish pounds. So when I shred, I am at about 200 grams of protein, about 300 grams of carbs, and about 55 grams of fat. So I really make sure that I don't drop the carbs too low, because I know you probably have this too, being kind of a naturally skinny, like, build, fast yeah, metabolism. Yeah, sure. I get really flat if I drop the carbs like to like 50 or 75, well, of course. So, I'm yeah, I keep my boat. Yeah, so what are you shredding macros? At 6'5", it's tall, it's hard, but 6'5", <laughs> 215 pounds. Okay. When I'm in my kind of shredding routine, I like to stick to around 325 grams of carbs. I'll stick to, I like my protein a little higher, like 280, 290 grams. And my fat, I keep nice and low at around 48, 
150 grams of fat. And I try and keep my trans fat as low as possible, like around, or my saturated fat's around 10 grams or so. Did you just have a burger? <laughs> and I just had a burger. We didn't show that though. That was, that was all the trans fat for the week. Oh, <laughs> no, yeah. California's it's getting fat. <laughs> yeah, man. So I think it, the most important thing is like you don't need to do a keto diet or completely eliminate carbs. You can get relatively, like, you can get super lean eating 250, 300 grams of carbs. Hell yeah. So, hell yeah. Counting your macros, it's, it's important just keeping track of what you're eating, how clean you're eating, and whatnot. Yeah. And like I said, I haven't, I haven't done isolation ab exercises in a long time. So, how about being in that deficit? You know, if you're in that three to 500 calorie deficit for eight weeks, you're going to get shredded. Hell yeah. That's how you do it. So awesome guys, so that is the little ad video we have for you. So make sure you check out his channel. I got a video on his channel. So I'm gonna link to that in the description below and I will see you guys on the next video. Later guys. If you ain't heard about games, you don't know about Superhuman TV. Troy, you ain't got no games. You ain't lift no weights. <laughs>